Hi, Earth Schoolers. I'm really excited about our project today. It's going to be a landscape similar to this fall scene right here. We are going to be blending colors. We are going to be layering wool. We are going to be using our single needle tool for some detail work. And we're also going to learn how to shade um, an object to look three dimensional. We're going to make the round little pumpkin right there. So it's going to be fun. Let's get started. And we might we might just be covering up this up with wool, so we might not be able to see our pencil marks anyway, but just to give us an idea to get started. And then over here, I thought we could do a nice big pumpkin. You can kind of do however you want. Maybe you want to make your sky a sunset and do different colors, whatever you choose. This is a fun part where you can just play and put your wool down however you want. and just play with it. I mean, you could put them up this way if you'd like to, but do you see how that looks like plants growing up? So you can really play with the wool that way to manipulate it and have it look how you want. Really give movement to your piece by um, using the wool in, in that way. So we need to decide where our light source is going to be coming from because that's gonna, um, show where like the shiny part like the highlight of the of an, the hill will be the brighter color is going to draw your eye um, down that way because green is um, you know more of a pure more of a pure color without being mixed it's going to draw your attention more than the mixed up with the brown pumpkins can be all sorts of knee shapes they can be lopsided, they can be tall and skinny, they can be short, they can be more round, more oval. So that's a beautiful thing about pumpkins. So you can kind of see how doing a, a circle like that is going to make it look round. Make your stem curvy, make it long, make it short, have fun with it. Every pumpkin is unique. I'm gonna have mine going up like that. Gonna, let's add our beautiful fall trees. So let's get orange, let's get red, let's get yellow. I'm just gonna do them all. So these are kind of like in the background. Our pumpkin is detailed in the foreground, but these trees in the background, I kind of want them to just be, you know, not exact. Okay, there is our fall scene, pumpkin in a field. I hope you enjoyed doing this one. Thank you, bye.